One of the most popular improvements in moving from HTML4 to HTML5 was the fact that in HTML5 it will let you embed video and audio elements extremely easily. It used to be in previous versions of XHTML and HTML that if you wanted to have audio you needed to have a player like Flash Player or Silverlight and that got very cumbersome because those update all the time. With HTML5 it's integrated right into the code so all that you have to do is have audio controls, put your audio source in, and then you have the alternate if it won't play your browser does not support the audio element and then you can then you close audio. So the outside is audio space controls inside you need your source mp3 plays everywhere I suggest that you use that and then close it. So you're gonna to have to do a few samples you want to use things that are royalty free I've provided references to the HTML audio tag and HTML5 audio that you can read more about it and these are two sources for free royalty free music you do want to keep your sound files fairly small and like images they need to be loaded into the same folder as your index.html and then the player is simply part of HTML5 and the correct way to use The correct way to use sound on a website is with a player like this. It's okay to have sound, but the sound should always be completely under the end user's control. So if you have a website for a band, it's completely appropriate to have players like this and let people listen to the music. It's not appropriate to have the music just play when the page opens.